everybody. Trippin' Sister here. And be striking, Mikey. I'm exhausted. Poor dear. You know the ant problem? Ah, <laughs> uh, yes, the ants, the ants. Right when we thought we were getting the, the ant problem beat, we pulled back the covers last night to go to bed and lo and behold, the ants are in the bed. <laughs> I couldn't believe it. It's not like we take food into the bed. But I think what drew them was I had a cough drop. Well, not the cough drop itself, but the paper was on the... Okay, you need to go that way. Oh, my I'm, God. I'm, I'm going this way. <laughs> oh, that person. Y'all, see? Oh. You see what happens? Here oh. I am going oh. down the road when all of a sudden the sister goes, Ah! <laughs> well, things, what was it? A sign. There was a sign. Things look a little different from my perspective. Anyway... Yeah, the ants were in, in, the, in the bed and on the nightstand, and oh my God, oh. Horror of It horrors. was terrible. Anyhow, we killed them, all the ones we could see. And of course, I didn't sleep well. <laughs> so, uh, anyhow, we're headed, where are we going? I'm so tired, I can't even think. We have left Colville, Washington, where we stayed at, that's right, Club Walmart. Stop looking at me. Look at the road. We were, however, right beside the highway, and immediately across the highway was a very large lumber mill, which runs three shifts, so they were clanking, clunking, and grinding all night long. Uh, the ants were driving the sister crazy. I, needless to say, quirked off right away <laughs> and went just, to sleep. He abandoned me. He just went to sleep and left me at the mercy of what could have been left of the ant colony. Anyway... We dealt out oh, wholesale slaughter to the colony before we uh, before yeah. we retired for the night, and then uh, woke up this morning, and we are now on our way to Sand Point, Idaho, where the sister has never been before. We're hoping to find a spot at a Corps of Engineers campground, and so we're heading eastward through the land of the Christmas trees. Through the land of the Christmas trees. So that's the plan. <clears throat> um, gosh, I got the heebie-jeebies. Every time I feel a little something, I'm thinking something's crawling on me. <laughs> oh my God, I didn't sleep last night. It's terrible. Anyway, uh, Sand Springs, whatever he just Sand said. Sand Point. Oh, okay, Sand Point. Idaho. I have been to Idaho more than once, but I don't think I've been to Sand Point. Sand Springs is just west of Tulsa. Anyway, bye y'all. There was a surprising amount of industrial traffic on the road which I we were taking, which was Highway 2. Here we are passing under a train trestle that was somewhat picturesque. And we're entering some little town. I don't know the name of this town, even though the sign is probably right in front of me, but I only have a little thumbnail to look at. So here we are in this little town, and we're leaving this little town, and we're traveling eastward along the Priest River, which joins up with Lake Ponderay. Hey, welcome to Idaho! <laughs> dun, dun, dun. Oh, we stopped at Albany Falls, and there was a juvenile eagle up in the tree. Now, you can't hear him, but he was shrieking away. So I, of course, was shrieking right back. He'd whistle loud, and I'd whistle loud. And he'd go, huh? There's a stone bench that was carved to commemorate 50 years at Albany Falls Dam. And there are the falls and the dam. And uh, so it's been generating power for over 50 years. Stop this th uh, video if you want to read more about Albany Falls. All right, folks, welcome to Sand Springs, Idaho. Sand Point, Sand Point, Idaho. Sand Point, not Sand Springs. <laughs> I think that's in Colorado. I don't know where it is. Sand Anyhow, Springs is west of Tulsa. Oh, well. Um, this is our stopping place for today. And we're going over to, are we going to a park? Where we're we going, going to the United States Army Corps of Engineers Springy Point Campground. 
And if the campground's full, then uh, we do have a reservation at Club Walmart. <laughs> <laughs> so that's that. I'll try to take some pictures when we get there if there's pictures that are worth taking. On. In the meantime, keep tripping. Well, here we are entering yet another little town. What's the name of this little town? I really have no idea. Oh, now we're in Sand Point, Idaho. I thought, well, we'll go this way because I know where we have to go. We have to go across the bridge. Uh-oh. Oh, this isn't the way to the bridge. This is road construction. One lane and clogged with fun-seeking pedestrians. Uh, but we did run across a few interesting old buildings. I guess this is the movie house. Or what used to be the movie house. Uh, the economy groceries. Yeah, if I want groceries, I don't want to pay an economy price. That's why we stay at Club Walmart. Here's a mural on the wall. I don't know what it's supposed to be, but it's kind of interesting. And now you'd think that Sandpoint, weren't we just in Sandpoint? Yeah, we were. Now we're turned around going the other way. And there is the downtown portion of Sandpoint, where we just were with Grace. Now we're going along the causeway, which is heading out south on Highway 395. It's quite a long causeway before you get to a bridge. Yes, and the bridge itself uh, is a very long bridge across Lake Ponderé, which being translated means earlobe. Yeah. What are you going to do? Oh, heading up to Earlobe. Anyway, so we headed south, and then here we are heading north again. And the reason for that is coming up right about here. Hi, guys. Well, we're at the uh, uh, a campsite here in Sand Point, Idaho, but uh, no one's here at the office, and it's $21 a day plus $10 for an extra vehicle where we're towing our van. So we're headed to Walmart. Have a good one. We'll see you back on the road. Keep tripping.